replaced me. Nah, you hated it anyway. So cheap. What? You mean? What the hell was that? Ah, uh, yep. Fucking ads, day and night. Recruited by Vargas. He's stupid. Thanks. How'd someone like you end up here? My owner bought me from some junk dealers, revamped, reprogrammed, and finally infused me with her spirit. Gape Earth and this unhappy wretch in tomb, or change my form whence all my sorrows come. The tree still planted in the unfinished part, not wholly vegetative, and heaved her heart. Your programming sounds... ancient. 
What can I get you? Bioscans, behaviorals, all based. Ah, V, you're here. It's about time, too. We're nearly done finalizing the plan. Mm hmm. So you say. Just a small difference of opinion to I know. Before NC, we worked in Op in Colombia. Medellin. Song's Not first now, mission. Alex. We have enough to do without digging up ancient history. We don't have all day. What happened in Medellin? What was the op there? We had our size trained on a guy who sat on the Colombian president's back pocket. Sold him smuggled corp tech. You saying the FIA pulls strings overseas? A lot of what we do doesn't get printed in the norm sheets. Anyway, we used stolen identities on that mission, too. Things didn't go exactly as planned, but that's... a long story. I think we can spare 60 seconds. Hell, might even learn something about Somi that'll prove useful. All right. Our person of interest was one Luis Hernandez, arms trading heavyweight. We aim to plant our own SA in his organization. Alex had adopted the identity of an engineer from Hernandez's entourage. She was our ticket in. She walks in to attend a meeting one day. She sees one of Luis's bikini model girlfriends prancing out on her way to walk his dopamine. Spending big money on Kiss Luxury. It was kind of his M.O. So what happened? Well, Somi had put together Hernandez's dossier. Problem was, an important detail slipped through the cracks. The engineer's abject fear of dogs. Cold sweat, shaky hands, soggy pant leg, that kind of fear. When the Doberman sniffed Alex's knee, she pats him on the head and says, who's a good boy? Then she went to pull up a chair at Hernandez's table. Before she could sit down, they had two barrels to her head and one trained at the base of her spine. What did you do? Well, my hands are bound, got a sack on my head, hear a collapsible baton snap into place, flack. I did what anyone do in that sitch. I lied my fucking ass off. Don't sit quite straight to this day, though. Okay, back to Night City, folks. With our sights trained on a new target. Parse the intel from the shard Somi gave us. It's a solid foundation for the mission we want to run. Surveillance, recon, data gathering, planning, it's all done. It's high time we righted some wrongs of the past. Fuck off, Reed. Give it a rest, will ya? Nothing here's your fault. Woman's an adult, made her own decisions. Consequences caught no, up to her. She was manipulated. There was no one around who could have had her back. Here, V. Mission details on this. Stop worrying, Reed. We'll get her out. Save her. I know. And not just her. That goes for you, too. Right. Our objective. To free Somi from under Hans's duress. Unfortunately, 
This ain't a normal rescue robbery. Because, well, she's been infected with something from beyond the Black Wall. A consequence of her service to the NUS and President Mines. I'm not about to pretend I understand the tech wise and how. The important thing is, if she doesn't get treatment, then a killer. The cure is an AI that lives on a neural matrix. Hansen possesses said matrix now. We aim to seize it. So this is neural matrix, how much do we know? Experimental tech nested in a mainframe that someone dragged up from deep beneath Dogtown. From a bunker, to be exact. Part of Project Sinusure, a joint U.S. Militech operation mounted in a bid to counter our Osaka soul killer. The Matrix itself is a functional container. It houses an AI from beyond the Black Wall, and its design lets the user deploy the AI for a specific purpose. In our case, to fix you and Songbird. All right. Plan. Let me hear it. Hanson to meet with the Netrunners you already know. The meeting itself is our chance to get close. To Song and the Matrix. Hanson hired the French duo because they worked for Militech years back. They know its security protocols inside out. Also, they're selling Hanson access codes. Handy when Songbird goes to extract the Matrix from the Sinusure mainframe. Hanson's gunning for data from what he knows was a secret Militech NUS research project. He has no idea the neural matrix is in there, too. Runners, scans, and behaviorals we have. Now we just need to take those twins out of the equation. Emmerich and Aurora Cassell. We know anything more beyond what we saw firsthand? Yep. Songbird put together full profiles for both. Super short brief. They got their start at Militech and dove in deep. That is, till they learn the pay's better on the dark side. Yeah, I buy that. Sure didn't hide their love of Eddie's. Mm-hmm. Gonna miss that next paycheck, because they ran into us. We're gonna nab them before they reach Hansen. So we kidnap them. How we want to do this? They're driving a rental while in NT. An exploitable opening. We're gonna track their ride and hijack it. Before they reach Hansen at the stadium. That's where you come in, V. We'll need you to breach the rental firm's tracking system. Alex will fill you in later. Once we have the runners, you'll take their place. The behavioral imprints are tuned already. And you're rolling all this, Reed? I'm drawing up your X-Flow route. Once you complete the mission, you need to get out in a hurry. I'll provide transport, make sure the path's clear and problem-free. Brings us to the final stage, right? Meeting with Hanson. Right. Where well, you'll sell them the access codes to the mainframe. In other words, the key to unlocking your medicine cabinet. One of you will join Somi in the lab to feed in the codes when needed. Hansen's likely to keep the other at his side. Collateral. I'll stay with Hansen. You'll join Songbird. Once the data floodgates are open, you'll signal me. Gonna disarm Hansen, take him and his guards out. Hansen and his goons. Aim to handle them on your own? Can do a lot more than play dress-up, thank you. Plus, element of total surprise in my corner. Still, sweet of you to worry. Sounds like Flatline and Hansen set in stone. Order came directly from Myers. Confirmed at the state. He took a potentially lethal swipe at the president of the NUS. And Songbird? We have to rescue her. Myers told you as much yourself. All clear? If you have any questions, now's the time to ask. First step, what was it again? Securing a trace on the Netrunner's car. This bit's on you. Alex will expand on that in a minute. Meanwhile, we'll make sure the personality data and imprints are airtight. Main goal, want to make sure I'm clear. We're springing Songbird free from Hansen's iron grip and seizing tech that's gonna save your lives. You and Alex enter the stadium as Hansen's visiting Netrunner's. Disguise is our key to the op. How much have you told Myers? What's she know? That Somi's fallen into the hands of the man who's organized the downing of Space Force One. Is that all? All for now. Things couldn't be clearer. Let's get to work. So, time we talk nabbing the runners? Cover that in a minute.
And any for your thoughts, Alex? About all this? Honestly? Still wondering why neither of us went back to DC. Not me, not Reed. They put him to sleep, saddle you with a Dogtown assignment. Who are you kidding? Say we disobeyed orders, gone back. A dressing down by some bureaucrat would be the worst we'd have had to endure. Think... Think we were both waiting for something, like the downing of Space Force One. Probably makes us a sad fucking pair of hypocrites. Myers doesn't know the deeds of this op, does she? Never will, is that right? It's not wrong. So we serve Hanson up on a silver platter, it will be salutes and handshakes. Shit goes sideways, we're royally fucked. Welcome to the agency. You know Reed better than I do. What he thinks. What's his true aim here? Saving so me or carrying out a mission? Saul imagines he's responsible for her. Always has. Thinks he's responsible for all of us. Hell, even for you, I bet. It's how he keeps his grip on reality. Life. With mixed results, mind you. Hmm. And so me? Same story as always. Dares, lands neck deep in shit, somehow crawls out. Rinse and repeat. Intercepting the runners. How do we do that? They're driving a rental. Plans to break into the rental service system. Karen Exotics. Specializes in rare models. Karen has tracking stations around the city. Gain access to those? We find the car easy. There's a station not far. Near Pacifica Serenity Bible Church. Check it out. The stations? How do they work exactly? They ping vehicle IDs across the network. Monitor location, tire pressure, all of that. Hack them, and it'll be open season on the runners. So, breach the station, trace the car. Good. What then? Use this little doodad. It'll pop the locks on the doors, let you take complete control from the trunk. Dunno. Anything goes wrong, I'll be stuck in there. Suck it up. This is FIA Trunk Ops, soldier. <laughs> Seriously, though, the tech just works. And we'll have your back the whole way. You know, Kabuki's tech wizards sell similar stuff under the counter. Wouldn't ever call it reliable. Well, fed tech wizards are just more skilled than Kabuki's. Better be. When you think you're near a station, scan your surroundings. They're not concealed. Shouldn't be tough to spot. Get right on it. talk long but two things quickly first good news i managed to upgrade your relics firmware you'll see what i mean in a minute don't worry completely painless How'd you manage it? No easy feat, I guess, tweaking tech that advanced. Mm, let's say I've had extra time on my hands. More than I expected. Don't worry. We're getting you out of there. I know. 
first good news, you said. Is there a second thing? Right. It's super important. It stays between us. It's gotta. Proof of my trust. I'm sending you coordinates. Come after dark. We should be able to talk freely. Okay, meet to Delta. We'll see you soon.
You and me, face to face. Sure we're alone. Wouldn't want any unpleasant surprises. No surprises. Except maybe you're already one of us. Don't trust a soul. This spot. Didn't pick it at random, I guess. Guessed right. Wanted to show you something. Means a lot to me. Could help put some things in perspective. And it means I trust you. Come over here. So what's so special about this place? Lived just two blocks off while I was here in NC on assignment. Locals come here after sunset. Fire up grills, crack open beers, talk about nothing in particular. Swing by here come evening sometimes. All of it. Every inch is special. Reminds me of Brooklyn. Actually from there. Wouldn't mind hearing about it. Brooklyn. Hmm. Got this memory. It was the night before I raided a Militech data form. I'm sitting out on my fire escape. Just lit a J. Down on the street, I see a party starting. There's playful screams and laughter. Someone's blasting funk from their stoop. I hear Willie, too. Sells the best scoff dogs around. He's shit-talking one of his tunes. And there's bonfire smoke in the air. Safe. Familiar. Were they celebrating something? Yeah. A Thursday. Know how you feel. Wasn't anything like Brooklyn, my home, but... Got a memory you cherish? It never gets peaceful where I'm from. Just know that wherever I am in the world, it feels like I'm walking Haywood streets. Yearning to go back. Can't rewind the clock, V. By the time you realize you missed something, it's usually too late. <sighs> Suppose we should get back to the here and now. Songbird, need you to be straight with me. I... I helped Hansen spring the trap on Myers. Maya did the deal in exchange for the neural matrix. I down the plane, deliver Myers, yes. But blast her out of the sky, then hunt her down? Wasn't what we agreed. You betrayed her. Not just her. Nothing went according to plan. What a fucking mess. Sent Myers' entire flight crew to an early grave. Myers herself too, almost. Ground the plane. That was the plan. Didn't expect he... Blow it to shit. Not much of an excuse, I know. So what was your plan? For you to rescue Myers while I secured the AI Matrix. And for us to run. All before Kirk caught on. Now Hansen's changed the terms of our deal. They'll make him answer for the attack. He knows that, so he's covering his ass. The one thing he doesn't know is what's on the Sinusure mainframe. He's hoping it's data he can use as leverage against the NUS. Says that's my ticket to freedom, but... As soon as he gets his hands on it, I'm dead. I just know it. It fucked everything up, I know, V. But I had no choice. Still don't understand why. Wasn't any other way, honestly. Wouldn't have resorted to this if there was. For Myers, V. 
The NUSA? Um, just another weapon in their arsenal. A tool for reaching beyond the Black Wall. And weapons and tools? They don't get to make decisions or choose to retire. Burden of past mistakes. We both bear it. It ain't easy. Me for the biochip, you for the black wall. You mean to say it's my fault? No, just that when you try to save yourself, it's usually somebody else who pays the price. Hmm. Yeah. Ain't that the brutal fucking truth? You're the only one I can trust with this. Only question is, after everything you just heard, feel the same way about me? Why not just go home? My home burned down when I was forced to trade warm Brooklyn brick for sterile Washington walls. I have nowhere to go back to. I want to ask, actually, what happened exactly, you know, when you reached past the Black Wall? Now the feeling when you try to remember the address of a place you lived half your life, but it just turns up blank. Mean losing your memory? A snowflake lands on my glove. I can calculate its unique fractal structure. But what did my mom's voice sound like? Sometimes I, I lose control. Or get the sense I'm surrendering to someone else. But it feels horrible. Felt it too, with the Chimera. Like a living nightmare. Yeah. More and more, I get the sense someone's standing behind me. But there's never anyone there. Don't trust Reed? Guy wants to save your life. Mm-hmm. He saved me once already. Word of a boss shit on Militech crossed his desk. So he knocked on a 19-year-old girl's door with an offer she couldn't refuse. Uh, join and serve or become a Netwatch trophy. That girl died that day. The person in front of you is what was born from that death. Of course, Reed, he died too. Just more recently. Seven years ago. The NUS issued his death sentence. Yet he serves the country to this day, clinging to something that's lost all meaning to me. Get the feeling this is the first time you've been honest with me. Yeah, with you and myself. I need to get away. From Kurt, the NUSA, Reed, from everything. Speaking of, out of everybody out there, you saw Hansen as a trusty ally. Seriously? I needed someone who could tear me from Meyer's grip. I knew him from my time in Night City when I was posted here. Took a steep risk, all right. And a plain gonk wanted that. That's why I enlisted you, too. Night City's just a pit stop along your escape route. That was always the plan, wasn't it? Yeah. It's just... Things got complicated. Messy. Certainly didn't expect my old agency chooms to get involved. Or to find myself caged by Kurt. I'm fleeing, B. Gotta get out. And to do that, I need you. Cause you... You know how it is. How am I to know this isn't an elaborate con? It'd be nice to have some kind of guarantee. I can't give you one, sorry. But I've shown you my trust. I mean, you're free to sell me out to Reed, right? Or trust me enough to save us both. No guarantee for either of us. Fair deal, I say. Okay. Say I believe you. What's the next step? We go through with the mission. Grab the neural matrix. While Reed and Alex grapple with Hansen, we make our getaway. 
And then... You helped me skip town. I already cut a deal with the Black Clinic far, far from Night City. There, the Rippers can access the Matrix and use an algorithm to create a prototype of our cure. They'll need me present to run their tests. The moment they're finished, I'll send word. And... that's it. Everything. Like a weight off my shoulders, honestly. Now, I have to ask. You're in this because you understand me? Or because I promised to save your life? Should be pretty clear. I mean to survive, too. I appreciate your honesty. <sighs> I guess that's all. I suppose you should call Reed. Let him know all set for the meet with Hansen. Hey, I'm Nova. Thanks. How are you? Put a cold beer in front of me once this is all over. Then we'll have time to chat. For now, fill me in on what you managed to get done. So me contacted me. Got news. Let me hear it. Well, first off, we've been greenlit. Our VIP's ready to be served. Music to my ears. What else? Songbird opened up a bit. About her sitch. It's looking bad. Real bad. His texts are only shot. I hear you. I do. All the more reason to focus on the mission in front of us. Get our hands on that cure. But Reed, what Somi spilled, we really need to talk. I know, but later. Not a topic for the hollow. We need that car tracking, so get to work. We'll go from there. Once you get the encryption key from this system, let me know immediately.
Great. Just great. Got a problem, Alex. Gonna take more than breaching one station to recreate the encryption key. Fuck. Give me a sec. Okay, got another station for you to try. Think we're good with just one more? <laughs> it's a car rental company, for Christ's sake. How sophisticated a system can they have? Let's get to it. Good luck out there. And raise Reed as soon as you grab that encryption key.
Looking for something? Won't find it here. Nothing to find. Hey, that your mom? She doing all right? Uh-huh. She's fine. Sure about that? Dunno. Maybe you ought to tell someone. Nah, she just came down from two days of BD. And she'll wake up soon, snarf a scop dog, and cry about having a headache. She always does that. Karen Exotics. I work for him. Need to fix our transceiver. Whatever. Borked. It ain't working? <gasps> Jesus. You want a hint? I can tell you how to fix it if you really want to fix it. Old people need help with this stuff sometimes. So, yeah, turn it off first, then turn it back on. You know, I can tell you where to look for the on button for a thousand ads. Interested? Okay, Eddie's are all yours. Nova, done deal. So, switch, where is it? I don't know exactly, around here. Telling you where to look, not where to find it. Just like I said. We'll play hot and cold. If you're close or far, we'll holler hot or cold. Let's start playing. You'll get it. Surefire fixes. Hard reboot or hard kick. <laughs> yo, yo, yo! Don't even think about flatlining here! I'm gonna touch a corpse! This. This gotta be what having a fucking stroke feels like.
Here's to you, Carnalito. Hey, you made it. Got a head start. A drink to calm the nerves. Thought I'd be a no-show? In the habit of considering every possible outcome. I wrote you because... Because I needed someone to talk to. Someone outside the firm. And not some total rando. To take my mind off the mission, not worry about being someone else for a millisec. Hope that makes sense. Okay. So, what you want to talk about? I mean, it's not like I have an agenda typed up. I just want... To be a normal fucking person for a little bit. Myself, specifically. Just me. Just Alex. Starting to make a lot more sense why retirement was your condition to accept the mission. Guess you'd call it burnout. Or maybe just the need for anything resembling normal. If I even know what that is anymore. Say, you ever think about who you'd be now if, you know, life had taken a different turn? I'd probably be running the streets. <laughs> hey, would at least, that I know. Padre might have something to say about that. You know each other? Well, I know him. Kinda doubt he's got a file on me. To your health. Okay, now you. Who would you be if not a secret agent and master of disguise? An actor. No hesitation there. Always dreamed of seeing my face on a show bill. I love musicals especially. Seriously? <laughs> Call me old fashioned. So yeah. Guess I'd be a brain dance star. Hmm. <laughs> Got any dream roles? Norma Desmond, Sunset Boulevard. <laughs> Guessing that doesn't ring any bells. <laughs> Not a single one. No surprise. It's ancient, far as films go. I have a soft spot for tragic characters. Not to mention, I see something of myself in her. Neither of us know when to let go. To our dreams. For they alone keep us sane. Ain't that the truth? I love this song. Never know when which ways up down. It's never what it seems when it's all I'm ever missing. And it feels as though I'm waiting. And I don't need no head in my hands. No, I'm ever heading way south I think I'll find it all Somewhere between the ice and fire Cause it's all I'm ever thinking I don't, hear don't do this often, I'm guessing right Busted moves? <laughs> Can't say I do What gave it away? <laughs> Wasn't thinking of dancing, but never mind
We'll see you on BD posters in no time. I know it. First, retirement. See you soon, V. Got a Delta. Later. Okay, you were saying... Hey, I got the encryption key for Karen Exotics. Nice work. V, one other thing. You need new chrome. An implant that accommodates behavioral imprints. I'm sending you deets for a clinic. A doc will be expecting you. Just tell the Ripper you know she collects unification war trinkets. She know you came with my blessing.
Hello? Hello? You Frida? Yes, and we're closed. Got something might interest you. I doubt it. Here you collect trinkets. Unification warrior. Mm-hmm. Come in. I'm sorry I was unwelcoming. Ever since a certain space plane crashed nearby, I've had to be more cautious. V, good to see you. Huh. Here to see me? Things are in flux. Situation's changing fast. I thought we should talk. I'm here about Somi. I spent hours wrapping my head around this, putting myself in her shoes. I needed to understand what she must have been going through, too. To resort to treason. Basing your expectations on the woman you used to know, not on who she is today. Common denominators remain in place. She's trapped. Not just here and now, but going months back. Hell. Actually, years. I blame Myers, the sore loser. Does her damnedest to avoid it. Songbird, 
the black wall, dirty tricks meant to give her a competitive edge. It's no wonder Somi doesn't trust anyone, except maybe you, a little. Song should trust you, not me. That it? I can't say I really blame her. I can only blame myself. But could you have done anything differently? Something, anything, instead of giving in and being exiled in Night City a couple thousand miles away. There's a prison cell prepped and waiting for her already. Somi knows that full well. She lives to see tomorrow and every day after. That's what matters. Myers needs her life, sure, but forgive and forget the attempt on her life? Never. Myers might not forgive her, but doesn't mean I can. Coming from a federal agent? Saying you want to get her home doesn't sound so warm and fuzzy. I will get her home. Exactly how remains to be seen. Okay. We break the chain Hanson wrapped around her neck. Then what? We stow away somewhere safe. Ask some questions. Establish some common ground. Once I get the answers I'm looking for, I'll personally help her disappear. From everyone, everywhere. Including Myers. Want to ask you a few questions, huh? To understand her side. Got an idea already of what I'll hear. System broke her. Almost took her life. Like it did mine. As for me, well, my time's well past. But so is still worth saving. You know, some would call that treason. Tell me something I don't know. I got contacts in Europe. We'll find the best clinic, put you two back together, fix what's broken. Once we have your cure in hand. But I need to help Somi first. She's lost, and I'm concerned she doesn't know what she's doing. You don't trust her? What I don't trust is the shit from beyond the black wall and the attendant paranoia. Both in play here, I'm afraid. She has another plan in mind. I'm damn sure of it. Read you loud and clear. So what's it all mean next? I have something for you. Our best minds in DC cooked it up. Icebreaker. Silver bullet against any fortified netrunner. Farida will feed it into your system during surgery. Use that, and Somi will drop unconscious within a minute. We can't take any chances, and when she wakes up, she'll wake up at home. She could sense the breaker. Not talking about some run-of-the-mill runner here. It's metaheuristic hyperaggressive tech, cobbled together by a literal army of experts. If she does sense it, it won't matter. No one out there, alone, could withstand something like this. Sure this soft will work? Doubt it's been tested on anyone's Songbird's level. From what they tell me, this program can anticipate what she'll do before she even thinks to do it. By the time you cut one thread, it's already found another. A precision-guided weapon designed to evade countermeasures. Okay. How do I use it? Fire it up when you're both jacked into the mainframe. At that moment, Somi's door will be wide open. <sighs> this will turn to shit. Who says it has to? <sighs> Dunno, man. But say you do corner her. Expect the unexpected, if you know what I mean. There comes a time when all expectations are null and void. Right now, we're focusing on saving your lives. Talking time will come later. It's time I was on my way. I leave you in Farida's able hands. Call me once you're done here. The sooner we begin, 
The sooner we finish. I need to do anything or... 20 questions first? Should I hold your hand? No. Do nothing. Tush? Meet chair. Okay. Anesthesia incoming. Don't worry, it's the good stuff. Relax and submit. An ID modding implant is complicated tech, true. But the procedure is surprisingly simple. To be honest, I've never heard of tech like this. <laughs> Seems kind of sci-fi. This an FIA prototype? Mm-hmm. It was picked off the corpse of a Militech R&D project. Militech abandoned it? That, or they sought to keep it off the books. Top secret. Mom's the word. Politics. Okay. Anesthesia's taking hold. Bridgeting, you want it to be crooked? How many fingers, my Stop Bridgeting, no. you want it to be crooked? <laughs> nice to see you in good form. Mm -hmm. You want something from me? To chat. Got no other options. You'll have to do. So tell me, what's it feel like to be a traitor? Interesting way of saying undercover FIA agent. Shit, actually bought into this. They send you to a fancy party, stroke your ego, and now you're some kind of super spy? What's next? Fucking gold medal? Ticker tape parade? A statue? A national holiday? Kids home from school? What the fuck? But seriously, found yourself in a shitastic situation. Come on, got iron in your hand. Gotta put I it to someone's head. Pull the trigger. The master spy and the agent unloosed. Tragedy, comedy, or both. I think one of them's trying to dupe me. No, they're both telling the truth. I mean, might be muddy on the nitty gritty, but their motivations are plain and clear. Survival. It's her be all and end all. That and she's a walking, talking nuke. The kind that keeps making mistakes, never knowing which one's gonna set her off. And Reed? Bastard and me are one and the same. If I hadn't ghosted the army, I'd have become a Reed myself. Live and die by our principles. That's the tragedy, V. Someone's gonna play victim to the other's good intentions. Try not to forget that when you're standing over that fucking overgrown neuro drive. Reader Songbird. What would you do in my shoes, Johnny? I am in your shoes, dumbass. For every gonk choice you make. But I can't do dick. But honest to God, V, not fucking around? I don't know. Got no goddamn clue. Well done. The facial morph implant is online. 
Now all you need is a behavioral imprint. And do me a favor. Don't tell me what you need this for. Might pop by if I need anything else. I can't wait. <laughs>